I'm here with performance coach Chris Gores, and we're going to show you four great active stretches for soccer players. These stretches are great for before a competition or before a workout, and they can be done anywhere with no equipment. This stretch is called the active straight leg raise. What we're going to do with this stretch is activate the quad to help build hamstring mobility. Yael, yeah, you're going to lie down on your back. Keep your right leg on the ground completely straight with your heel down. Good. Now you're going to bend that left leg into 90 degrees. Hold that with your arms lightly. The arms are not activating the stretch here. The arms are just holding the leg in place. Now to stretch, what she's going to do is fire her quad, extend the knee, point her toe down towards her face, hold for two seconds, and then back down. That's one rep, all the way up. Hold for two seconds, squeeze the quad, and back down. The more you squeeze the quad, the better stretch you'll feel in the hamstring. Two more. Good, last one. Good. This stretch is called the quad hip flexor stretch. In this stretch, what you'll do is fire the glute to help stretch the quad and the psoas. Yael will start on her right knee with her left foot out forward. From there, she's maintaining good posture with her upper body, activating her core, and then from here, she's just gonna squeeze the glute on the right side, shift the hips forward, hold for two seconds, and then back in. Let's do that again. Squeeze that glute, hold for two seconds, and then back in. Good. More. Good. For an added stretch, what you can do is as you're squeezing the glute, leaning forward, raise that right arm up to the ceiling. Good. And back in. Good. All the way up. Hold. One, two. Good. If you want. This next stretch is called the world's greatest stretch. It targets a lot of different areas in the lower body and it's great for before and after games. The L, you're going to start in push-up position. Good. Maintain good posture with your upper body. Now, keeping your left leg completely straight, let's lift your right leg all the way up. Place that onto the ground. It's very important to keep this bottom leg completely straight. Now what you'll do is drop your elbow down into the instep. Hold for two seconds. Good. Bring that back up. Turn to the right. Reach to the ceiling. Hold for two seconds. Again, maintaining a good stretch in the back leg. And then grab that front foot. Pull back. And back down. Good. Let's go through that whole thing one more time. Elbow to the instep. Turn. Grab and straighten both legs. Make sure you're straightening both legs there. Good. Relax. And let's go ahead and do the other side as well. Back leg is completely straight. Elbow goes to the instep. Perfect. Turn. Perfect. Back down. Straighten out both legs. Raise the hips. Good job. One more time. Elbow to the instep, turn, grab the foot. Good, and relax. This next stretch is called the pretzel. In addition to being another great stretch for lower body mobility, it also focuses on shoulder mobility. The yeah, outline down on your right side. From here, what you're going to do is bend that left knee to 90 degrees and hold that down with your right hand. Good. Now, you're going to, bob, the bottom leg is going to bend back. Good. Hold that. You're going to take a deep breath in. Exhale. Rotate all the way over. Hold for two seconds. And then back in. So here what we're doing is we're stretching the quad, the hip flexor. If she wanted more quad, you can pull back on this leg a little bit more. We're getting great mobility in the T-spine as well, up here, and shoulder mobility. For questions, or to request an individualized program, contact Chris directly on his website, www.trainergores.com. Subscribe to the Wide Football channel to catch the videos from this series as we release them, and for more content on how to reach the top of your game.
Thank you.